now i am going to show you how to send email using laravel in order to show that task i am first going to google and here i will search by mail trap i will use this tool in order to check if email is sending uh, correctly or not so first login here i am going to login here using my email address so if you click on login you will see that here will be some login options and i will login here now after login using your email address you will see an interface like this you see that here is a email testing and email sending so as i am going to check the uh, to check the email uh, so this is actually not will be my real email so i will just use the testing so start testing button click here the inbox will open for the email test and you will see that for the email testing there is a inbox and here you see in the show credential option they give you all the information about the smtp so from here i will just use these items and in my laravel where i freshly installed a version here under the folder laravel practice this is a fresh installation so here i am going to dot env file now and into the env file you will see that there are some mail attributes here mail mailer mail host mail port etc so from this place i am going to use the credential for example the host is like this so i am going to copy this and i am going to bring that here that is where is my mail host so here i paste it after that there is a mail port so i am going here again and there are some ports i can use i can use any port i want like this there is a username username is this i am going to copy from there and paste it here that is username i am now going here copy the password and i am going here paste it here and mail encryption and mail encryption it is given tls okay that is good i am going to use the tls and here is a from address for example if you are admin and if you want to send the email to your user then you can just give your email address here for example i am going to give here my uh, example email address contact at the rate of my website dot com so this is my email address for example and mail mailer smtp is okay so my setup in that dot env file is completed now i can easily close this it, it will not be needed for now so in this way what i did i just am going to use a fake email service so if the email that i will try to send using the mail trap if it is if it works perfectly and that thing will must be or uh, work perfectly on your real server now i am going to start my uh, coding so i go back to my vs code and here i will open the terminal now in order to send email i will use the make mail function so here i will write php artisan then make mail command artisan command will be make mail so using the artisan command make mail i will create a uh, file that will be for example test mail i just give it the name test mail enter you see that the mailable that means into this location a mailable class is created successfully so a mailable uh, it will be uh, it is created into the app you see that mail and this is the actually test mail.php i am going to open it here so it is calling the mail mailable class and will use this because you see that my class that is test mail extends the mailable class so here i will write my codes i am going to create a uh, controller to show you how email uh, is sent so i am going uh, to put here php artisan make controller i will create a controller and for example the controller name is test controller just like this okay so here what is my next step into the test 
male in this case what i will do here you see that there is a, a constructor like this constructor function when i am i will send an email i will actually need uh, two things one is subject and another one is body so here i am going to call uh, to create a variable one is subject and another one is body like this and into the constructor as parameter i am going to use the subject and then body and into the constructor i am going to call it like this subject equal to subject and i am going to define here this body this body this equal to body like this and you see that after that there is a envelope function in the envelope function what i will do here you see there is a subject in the envelope this one is mandatory that is subject but they put here a test mail subject but for some reasons it may be needed that i um, create subject into my co controller and then pass it here as a parameter so for this reason you see that in the top i define this subject so i am going to copy that and i am going to use that here instead of hard code so this subject now you see there is a function that is a content function and in the content function actually i will create uh, a file where i will write the body code that means which message you are going to send to the user using the email that code i will put into a blade file and that that blade file link i will have to give here for example this is simply email that means into the resource folder views folder this is actually my main views location so here what i will do i will create a file email.blade.php you if you create here another folder email then put email.blade.php then you will have to link that like this email dot email so just remember that i will just call this view file so i put here only the name email because my in the views i create email dot blade dot php so this view is created here and here i can simply write the code for the body that can be my body and as there uh, can be some new lines good format in paragraph so here i can just use this one also so i am going to use this symbol so okay my email dot blade dot php this body task is complete i am going to close this and this is my test mail dot php function and that is good now the last task is to write code into my co controller so i created controller into http controller here like this so this is my controller file so in my controller file in the top as i am going to use the mail mailable class so here i will use just here first you will use the mail and another one you will have to call that is my test mail.php class that means here i will use use app then that's location is actually into the mail folder app mail and then there is test mail you see that the test mail also here in this location app mail test mail okay so this is the includes in the top now in the body i will send email in order to send email i am going to declare here a subject variable subject equal to for example any subject you can give here test subject okay and another one i am going to give here who is on sorry here i will have to create a function public function index into the function i will have to define this okay now there is no error okay so one is subject and another one is message or body like this so test message for example here you can write a lot of things which you want to send the user as a email message and lastly i will have to call the mail to this one and then send 
so mail to means in that to you will have to call uh, you will have to write the email address of the user to whom you want to send the email so for example i am going to send the email to user at the rate of gmail.com it is the user email okay so here i will send the email and into the send function i will have to create an object of the test mail here you see that this is a class so here i will pass it like this new test mail and into the test mail i will pass my subject and pass my body because these two items i declared into the constructor here so here you see i created two variables here i put as parameter so here you also have to pass the uh, two variables as the parameter subject and another one is body so email will be sent just if you run this code now the email now should be sent but this test controller i will have to define into the route so i am going to my routes and web.php and here i am going to remove this and here i am going to use test controller then class and my function is index function and in the top i will have to call the controller app http controllers and this is test controller like this so if i now just uh, refresh this then an email will come here so let's check if it is working or not I am going to press enter you see that a blank page because I did not show any output here right now let's check if mail comes you see that a new mail comes a few seconds ago test subject if I go here you will see that my body message was only test message right like this test message and test subject was my subject that is showing here from where it is coming you see that this is the app name app name means here if you go to the env file you will see that in the top there is a variable app name that's name is laravel this one i call here mail from name so here you see the variable app name so as i am going to use the app name here so that is showing here as the user email name from from name and this is the email from where the mail is sent that is this one and to which person the email is sent that is my user user at the rate of gmail.com that i declared here like this Here are some other headers. If you see the header, you will see that you, if you want, you can use that BCC, the from field, etc. But I am going to just keep it simple and you see the test message is coming without any issue here. So in this way, you can simply send email using the Laravel.